all right then ladies and gents hello and welcome to crypto space everybody so guys in today's video we are going to cover pepe its recent price action and of course on the top of that we are going to cover a couple of interesting charts for you know altcoins and btc as well guys if you are new to the channel please consider subscribing and a quick disclaimer that this video is not financial advice all right then now let's hop into pepe itself so if it comes to pepe guys we are experiencing 6.8 percent of upside on a daily for a pepe at the time of recording this video obviously and the market cap is sitting at 5.2 billion usd now before we are going to get into the chart let's cover the holders last 48 hours that's 24th of june we were sitting at 247,397 holders and as of the time of recording this video we are sitting at 248,257 and that is 860 new holders in the last 48 hours so guys accumulation is going forward and now a quick look at the market so obviously as of the time of recording this video this is what's brewing right the daily winner is not in a cash network up around 10 percent all right guys let's have a look at the chart itself so first things first this is a two hourly time frame for pepe stochastic rsi is pretty much you know going down going downwards but that's okay and now guys we have flipped green on madrid ribbon as of you know 48 hours ago you know two days ago and i believe that this is going to be you know the bull trend now for pepe right and that next pump is going to hopefully be the same as this one right but obviously the time is going to show right now guys let's turn this thing off and let's go to four hourly time frames so guys if it comes to four hourly time frame stochastic rsi is you know looking like we are might gonna see the pullback right which is okay you know we might gonna dip into that level of let's say temporary resistance which is roughly in here and that is normal right just like we have you know closed above and then we have retested you know this level as a support so now if we are going to see a little bit of a pullback on a short time frame i believe that this is nothing to be worried about because obviously the daily time frame is showing us a different picture that blue line has escaped significantly from you know that orange line which you know to me at least it shows that this is a bullish trend now for pepe obviously right and as i said guys i do expect you know this level as a taking profit level for me but again i'm not over leveraged i'm not trading with leverage this is just a spot holding quick dca in quick dca out and just putting that into something else now guys let's have a look at the weekly time frame for pepe obviously i believe that this is going to be the last pump you know the one that we are currently experiencing for pepe and after that probably in my personal humble opinion we are going to see you know a different section pumping of course i could be wrong but let's see in coming days guys all right i do believe that we are going to see another let's say well 70 percent of gains for a pepe now guys quick update if it comes to etfs well actually we have a very bullish day of inflows of 31 million as of 25th of june obviously that's you know not a lot but it's still better than zero or negative now guys let's have a look at a couple of charts so first of all monthly macro chart for ethereum which i believe is quite important for pepe holders and shout out to trader taringrade eat monthly chart has shown this pattern if it moves as planned we can see seventeen thousand dollars in next year Fill up your bags with Ethereum in this consolidation box. This is definitely possible that we are going to see, you know, such prices for Ethereum this cycle. But of course, if you are into Ethereum, I wouldn't really necessarily say just wait until 17k and then, you know, take out profits. Obviously, you should take out profits along the way. But what I'm showing you that is obviously Pepe is built on Ethereum. And at the moment, this is number one, you know, meme coin in this cycle. And obviously, bigger gains for ETH bigger gains for pepe i believe and now shout out to the scalping pro he's saying that not many people are ready for this well what is he talking about so first of all 2013 all-time highs we had sideways price action then the big pump right we have reached the all-time highs in 2014 and then you know the next cycle in 2017 that obviously was you know sideways price action as well then we had sideways price action in 2020 and now we have sideways price action as well so guys i don't think that this is reason to panic now the scalping pro has got possible targets of let's say 300 k for btc and i do believe that this might gonna happen but of course 
you know take your profits along the way and now guys titan of crypto so big shout out and this is a daily chart he's saying that bitcoin is about to surge a hidden bullish divergence is forming for btc on a daily rsi in addition rsi attacked the oversold territory so let's have a look at the rsi all right guys every single time we are reaching that zone if it comes to rsi or you know when we are experiencing such levels then we are experiencing a pump towards the upside so i do believe that this time is no different for btc and now shout out to l crypto prop and this is two weekly chart for altcoins altcoins have been in falling wedge for over three years now if this breaks out to the upside altcoins will fly all the pieces of the puzzle are coming together more and more we are going to experience that squeeze sooner rather than later and i do believe that this is going to be huge right and this is the old season in 2021 right 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 after we have seen such a dip for old coins guys so you know that little dip i wouldn't really be worried to be honest and now shout out to mickey bull crypto and this is a monthly chart for btc he's saying that bitcoin cycle peak is not in yet expect a massive bull run after this final capitulation so now if it comes to z score we are nowhere near the previous peaks guys this is the first time and we are leaving these bollinger bands and before when we have touched the upper edge of that bollinger band you know in here we have experienced a huge rally so guys i believe that something massive is really coming for btc and crypto of course not necessarily after you watch this video but in foreseeable future i believe and this is a weekly chart by the way now mickey bull crypto is saying that bitcoin is a classic bull flag pattern on a weekly chart hidden bullish divergence currently in play he's expecting a summer impulse from that level guys that might gonna happen right we do have that bullish divergence obviously right and now we've got the bullish flag and which obviously as the name says you know the flag is bullish and now guys old coins old coins retesting the point of breakout with the price holding nicely around the one trillion mark uptrend imminent guys obviously that was our bear cycle right then the first leg up pull back blah 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 you know retest as a support and then the proper parabolic run so this cycle right we had the bear cycle right and now we are going upwards you know closing above retesting as a support sideways price action board and blah 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 shakeout and then hopefully the breakout towards the upside and now guys let's cover you know a couple of macro charts on my trading view so first of all if it comes to macro chart on a weekly of top crypto market cap guys we have just reached that white box okay so this is the first thing all right and we are sitting at what 2.2 trillion usd as of the time of recording this video and if it comes to stochastic rsi this is what is happening at the moment we have properly bottomed out so obviously i don't know for how long this is going to you know last for to be exact but what is going to come next is probably this so what most likely is going to come after this is probably something like that right let's see and let's wait now quickly let's have a look at others right others which are excluding a top 10 on a weekly chart guys all right so this is something that i'm showing you you know every now and then obviously we do have that cap and handle but we still haven't really you know close above this level of a resistance right not mentioning about all-time highs and of course not mentioning about you know this level in here of course i'm not not saying that you should wait you know with your crypto gains until here just make sure that you cash out some profits along the way all right and now guys let's have a look at others dominance so basically last cycle when this huge capitulation happened after that we have a reversal towards the upside and the question is is that going to happen this cycle we technically could dip a little bit lower but so what you know i do believe that the great things are going to come ladies and gents thank you very much for watching this quick update i hope that you have guys enjoyed and i wish you having a great day peace and love crypto